Hi guys, it's me Teacher Gon. In our today's video, we will do dividing polynomials long division and actually this is part 2 of our yesterday's video. So without further ado, let's do this topic. So what we have here is this problem. So this is the problem. We have 3x to the 4th power minus 12x plus 5 divided by x plus 1. And here it is. This is the given dividend and this is your divisor x plus 1. So you, you will write this in this form. Listen, huh? this is your dividend, x plus 1. And as you can see, from the original given, we only have 3x to the 4th power minus 12x plus 5. And here, in your dividend inside this, uh, this line, you have 3x to the 4th power plus 0x cubed plus 0x squared minus 12x plus 5. So kung kapansin nyo, uh, here, it started with the fourth degree and then going to linear term. Wala tayo yung cubic and quadratic. Kapag walang ganun, ang gagawin nyo, you will put plus 0 x cubed plus 0 x squared. Ganun yung kailangan mong gawin. Okay, let's start the long division. So again, here's the process. Divide, subtract, and multiply. Ayun yung routine natin. We will divide first the leading term which is 3x to the 4th power and x so again 3x to the 4th power we will use this part 3x to the 4th power divided by x and as you can see that is 3x cubed so where do we need to put this we will put this here at the top of 0x cubed because parehas sila ng ano parehas sila ng power so we have here 3 x cube. So we are done dividing. Next natin is multiplying. We will distribute this one by one. 3x to the third power times x, that is 3x to the fourth power. Next, 3x cube plus, ah sorry, 3x cube times one, that is plus 3x cube. Remember in process natin eh? Divide, multiply and then we will subtract and don't forget to enclose this by a parenthesis I will use here subtract and remember when you're subtracting this will become addition ito naman from, ad from positive magiging negative here from positive it will become negative so when we add them it will become 3x to the 4th power plus negative 3x to the 4th power magiging 0 in the end it will become 0 so next here, 0 x cubed plus negative 3 x cubed, that is negative 3 x cubed. And then bring down this one, okay? We will bring down plus 0 x squared. Those 0 na siya, you need to bring it down. Next, this term is to be divided by this term. Negative 3 x cubed divided by x. So as you can see, it will become negative 3 x squared. We will put it here above 0 x squared, that is minus 3 x squared. And after dividing, multiply. Negative 3 x squared times x is negative 3 x cubed. Next is negative 3 x squared times 1, that is negative 3x square and then subtract and don't forget to enclose it by parenthesis so what's next is we will change the sign or this operation will become addition this subtraction magiging positive this negative will become positive so what will happen is that ito na, negative 3x cubed plus positive 3x cubed, that is 0. 0 na yun, ha? 0. Ito naman, 0x squared plus negative 3, ah, uh, positive na ito, positive, uh, 3x squared, that is 3x squared. And then bring down minus 12x. We're not yet done, guys, ha? So, ito naman yung magiging leading coefficient natin to be divided here, that is 3x squared divided by x and definitely that is three, simply 3x we will put it here 
plus 3x. Now, multiply 3x times x, that is 3x squared. 3x times 1, that is plus 3x. Subtract, and again, don't forget to enclose it via parenthesis. What will happen is that we will change this into addition. This positive will become negative, and this positive will become negative. So, check natin. 3x squared plus negative 2x squared is 0. Guys, don't forget that. That is 0. Here, negative 12x plus negative na 3x that is negative 15x. And then bring down your plus 5. So what will happen here, ito yung bagong leading coefficient mo, negative 15, okay, negative 15, x divided by x, ito ah, is equal to negative 15. So the answer will be put up here, negative or minus 15. And then after dividing, remember ha, divide, multiply, and subtract. Negative 15 times x, that is negative 15x. Negative 15 times 1, that is minus 15 or negative 15. And then subtract ulit and close it via parenthesis, guys. So we will adjust this. Okay. Subtraction. So yung subtraction natin magiging addition. Ito from negative magiging positive. From negative magiging positive. So what will happen is that we will perform subtraction. Negative 15x plus positive 15x that is 0. Okay? And then here, 5 plus positive 15 that is definitely 20. So ngayon, we will check our solution. Ay, we will, uh, ano yung mga na natin? This will serve as your remainder. Again, ha? This is your remainder. And this is your quotient. Kapag meron tayong remainder, tinuro ko sa, sa, ibang, sa isang video natin, sa naunang video natin, is that, ito yung format natin, quotient, quotient, positive, negative, remainder, over your divisor. So, ano siya? Ilagay ko sa ibabo dito. 3x to the 4th power minus 12x plus 5 that is equal to quotient. Ito, copyin natin to. 3x cubed, sana magkasya siya. Minus 3x square plus 3x minus 15. So, kinopyin natin tong quotient. Positive, negative, diba? This is positive, so plus. Your remainder, which is 20, over your divisor, which is x plus 1. And ito yung pinakasagot natin, guys. Okay? So, I hope, guys, you learned something from this video on how to do long division or dividing polynomials using long division. And I hope you can subscribe to our channel and share this video. So, bye-bye!